Hello beautiful Aries and welcome to your video. And so let's get a general message for you. What is coming towards my beautiful Aries? Okay, so we have the businessman that wanted to come out and at the bottom of the deck. We have the performer. Okay, gorgeous energy. Okay, so for some of you, you could be in the performing arts and the entertainment industry. Okay, or maybe, you know, you're, you do something on a stage or where people have to look at you. You know, you could be on your phone, anything. Okay, I feel like you're going to be getting a lot of business. I'm hearing business is booming. People are going to be drawn to you. People are, people want to watch you. Okay, you're a brilliant performer. Okay. So a lot of people, um, you're gaining a lot of attention. This could be because you're really beautiful as well or something that you're doing is really, really beautiful. Okay, but yeah, you're getting a lot of business. I'm hearing business is booming. There could be somebody that wants to invest in you as well or this is you. Okay, so if you are an entrepreneur of any kind, you know, maybe business has been a bit slow. Um, that is about to change. Okay, so really gorgeous, gorgeous energy. Gorgeous, gorgeous energy. So the businessman, okay, so somebody wants to make a deal with you or something like that. Okay, you could be signing some kind of contract. Okay, so this is for my beautiful Aries. Yeah, I am strong and fearless when it's a come out. Okay, yeah, and this is my, my you know, well, this is Leo energy here. But, um, you know, this is kind of like my masculine, strong, independent card. So, yeah, I feel like there's something with the fist there. You've been fighting for something. So, maybe as well, you've been trying to keep your business afloat or you've been trying to do a lot of things on your own. And you know what I mean? It's just, it could, business gets hard sometimes, you know. Um, so I feel like, you know, you're strong, you're fearless. You know, when this card comes out as well, this kind of indicates to me that there's people that's fighting against something that you're doing or trying to stealth your growth in some type of way. Um, but you will emerge victorious out of this situation, okay? At the bottom of the deck, we have, I'm receiving messages from my ancestors. So yeah, ooh, see, look, just as I said that, you see how that just tried to drop? So like I said, I feel like you're, you're, you, you're suffering from a lot of like interferences, Somebody kind of wants to kind of knock you off your throne because that's literally what just happened there. Okay, one second, because I just have to make sure that that doesn't happen again. Oh, my good Lord. Sorry, beautiful Aries. Yeah, so I feel like, you know, maybe that's how it has been quite turbulent for you when it comes to certain things. Somebody wants to knock you off your throne because you have big star potential here, okay? Okay. I feel like you're about to take over the industry or, you know, you can make a lot of money when it comes to when it comes to something or something that you're doing. And, you know, with the performer, this could be like people in your audience or people around you. People are supposed to be helping you to be supportive, just trying to knock you off your game. OK, it definitely could be because you're really attractive as well. So people may not want you to be seen or they just see you as competition. OK, but you're going to fight through that because your ancestors have your back. Your ancestors are going to guide you okay when it comes to a situation so um let's get a love message for you let's see what is coming towards you in your love life because i'm hearing like all work and no play you know you've been working on something but you know you haven't really been able to enjoy your life or have fun or see the benefits of your labor but that's about to change my beautiful aries okay we just want one card please and thank you Okay, we have two cards, so we're just going to take it, okay? So we have um, love, the love at first sight, okay? Which reads, um, instant attraction, enamored, and fireworks, followed by the yin-yang twins, okay? Which reads, twin flames, balance, and unity, okay? And at the bottom of the deck, we have the retrograde, which reads, blast from the past, memories, and missing you, yeah. So obviously, there's somebody from your past, it could be your opposite sign, it could be a Libra, it doesn't have to be, but this is somebody who, as soon as you saw them, you just felt something, you just knew that you're supposed to be with this person, or you was instantly attracted to them, okay, I, I feel like you are this person's balance, so this person is really missing you, I feel like they're watching you, they can see you, they can see that you're fighting against something as well, I feel like somebody kind of wants to, um, they want to talk to you. Maybe somebody wants to help you out when it comes to your business as well. You, If you're dealing with someone, they, you could be in the same industry as this person. Or you're going to meet somebody and fall in love with them. Okay? But because of the retrograde, I do feel like this is, you know, somebody from your past who you've already met. They're just going to come out of nowhere, okay? Um, so let's just get some tarot. Yeah, the four of swords definitely could be dealing with a Libra, okay? So, yeah, I feel like you've been thinking a lot. Somebody has been thinking about you a lot. And you've been resting and healing from something as well. Or you've taken a break 
when it comes to something yeah the ten of wisdom at the bottom of the deck could be dealing with a gemini does not have to be okay i feel like somebody um wants to heal the breakup okay somebody is thinking about this okay also again you're going to have a breakthrough because like i said i feel like people keep trying to knock you off your phone people don't want you to achieve something but you know all the knives that you've been receiving in your back that is coming to an end. You're going to heal and you're going to emerge victorious. You also may heal a relationship with this person. Yeah, you're going to be independent, wealthy and successful. And you're going to be able to be in a relationship or be back on the stage where you belong. This is your card, the four of wands. Okay, thank you so much.